Tang. He's a lot stronger than I remember. When we fought him back in Elysia, he must have been weakened by Gramps' blessing. I'll burn you to cinders! Take that! <laughs> Miklio! <laughs> I'm going to enjoy this. A fitting end for worms who dare to wriggle at a god. <gasps> Boss! No, I swear, I, I wasn't. Quiet. <sighs> who, who are you? We won't warn you again. Be silent. Have you forgotten our code, Lunar? You're all out of second chances, understood? Go. The assassination order was a mistake. Princess Alicia will no longer be our target. You expect me to believe that? We have our honor. Stay. The princess's enemies are legion. For those who wish to remove her, assassination is but one option among many. You have bigger worries than who we are or what we do. I suggest you hurry to the pedestal where the sacred blade is kept. Why are you telling me this? Honor. So, I guess I should be thanking you for saving us. Hmm. <laughs> hey, are you alright? What? What in the world? Looks like we were saved by an assassin's guild. By a what? They were after Alicia by mistake or something. They took that fox guy away with them. But more than that, it looks like Alicia's not out of danger yet. Looks like? What's going on? Hey, I don't get it any more than you do. Let's just hurry to that pedestal. I don't think we've checked that monolith out yet. We can't go any further. There's gotta be some way. No entry. If you want to check out the festival, go out front. What gives? You're letting him through. Well, that's because I'm festival staff. That's right. Authorized personnel only. Everyone else, move along. But it's urgent. Can't you do anything? Afraid not. I've no time for this. You got authorization or not? Oh! This crest, it's Princess Alicia's. How's that for authorization? This is the real McCoy. I stand corrected. Go on ahead. Thanks! Hold it. Just in case, you'll leave your sword with me. 
Fair enough. Went through all that trouble, and we can't see the pedestal. Is that what you're thinking? <laughs> well, sorta. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> Being invisible has its benefits. Seriously? Hey, Saray, come over here. What is it? Saray? Alicia! Is that you, Saray? Welcome! And who may this be? This is Saray. Ah, yes. The one who rescued our princess way out there in the ruins. Saray, this is Lady Maltran. She's been appointed as the committee leader for the festival this year. She is also the one who taught me the way of the spear. Nice to meet you. I'm Saray. It is a pleasure. By any chance, did you come here to attempt the trial of the blade? Not just that. To tell you the truth. What this mysterious organization has told you is true. There are indeed those who think less than favorably of me. But even so, I cannot live my life in fear of them. But... but Alicia... Thank you so much, Saray. I really appreciate your concern. Soon, the finale of the festival, the Flames of Purification, will begin. Please enjoy yourselves. So this is what states people deal with. She didn't even flinch. Oh, that's right. Check out the pedestal. Oh, right. If no one else can see her, does that mean she's a Seraph? You probably can't remove the sword unless you can speak with her, meaning no ordinary person can do it. Incredible! So that means the legends were true. Hey, say something to her. Me? Unless you want me looking like a total weirdo. But still... Ladies and gentlemen, my fellow citizens of Lady Lake. For the past several years, we have abstained from our beloved festival in light of the general state of the world. But this year, thanks to the grace and assistance of Our Lady Alicia, the Sacred Blade Festival can be held once more. We yet live in a time of crisis. Violent weather, geopolitical tensions, pestilence, famine, the list goes on. However, I believe that it is precisely times such as these that make our cultural traditions and celebrations all the more vital to maintain. Oh, wondrous Lady of the Lake, show us your power! Merciful Lady of the Lake, hear our plea. Cleanse us of our sins and woes with your flames of purification. Citizens of Lady Lake, this jubilant festival shall be as a prayer to the heavens that we may know peace and prosperity. Some prayer, all right. This prayer of yours gonna give us our jobs back? 
The Council already seized the crops and weaponry trades for the state. They might as well declare war and get it over with. Hey, lady! You trying to kill us? This ain't nothing but the Council giving itself a pat on the back! Well, we're not gonna stand for it! Find someone else to lick your boots! Silence! Do not disturb the festival! Enough! Ha! Serves you right! <laughs> this whole riot was a setup. Look at that guard! This must be the work of the Chancellor. I can't believe they'd involve the citizens they swore to protect in a power struggle. Were we really so corrupt? Alicia! Saray, get to safety! No! You mustn't give in to hostility! Such emotions will breed Hellion! <laughs> To a hellion. The evil in people's hearts gives rise to malevolence. Once it reaches a certain point. Lady of the Lake! Can you do something? You have the power of purification, do you not? A soul? And you can see me? That's not good. Nick Leo, put those flames out! The black flames are part of the hellion itself. The most I can do is manage the regular ones. Okay. Saray, you really can see Seraph and This isn't looking good. The Hellions are coming out of the woodwork. The power of purification is not my own. It is a power given to those who would draw the sacred blade and become my sword. Then I'll do it. Saray! Do not be hasty! To become my sword is to serve as a vessel for me to dwell in and to assume the Shepherd's burden. Blessed with the power of purification and abilities beyond human ken, cursed to be scorned by others and wrought with despair. To protect this land from the Hellions means a constant stream of agonizing decisions. It is a lonely battle, the likes of which you can scarcely imagine. That's the burden of the Shepherd? And you want Saray to take all that on right here and now? It is not to be done lightly. May I ask you your name? Of course. I am Lila. Lila. My dream is to investigate ancient ruins all over the world. I believe that the legends of the past hold knowledge about how humans and Seraphim might one day live in harmony together. I must find a way to make that happen. To bring humans and Seraphim together again, as it was in the days of yore. If purifying the Hellions will save both humans and Seraphim, then... then it's the best chance I'll ever have to make that dream a reality. Are you really okay with this? Saray. That's why I shall become the shepherd. I offer myself to you as your vessel and shall bear your burden. I've waited long for this moment. For one who is pure of heart and free of corruption, a shining vessel to whom my words will reach.